Hi, I'm Lou with another episode of My Car Story. So right off the bat, I'm going to share with you this car, Cindy's car. And uh, Cindy was a huge fan of the channel and we got the chance to talk, but sadly Cindy uh, had some medical situation and uh, passed away. But I'm here with Craig Thompson, her husband, and uh, we know that Cindy, you're watching this video, so we love that. Craig, what year make and model is this one? It's a 1969 American Motors Ambassador SST. Let's take a look at Cindy's car. So right off the bat, we've got the sun on it. And by the way, it's a Sunday, so I'm sure she's watching right along with us. So tell me what it is about this car that she loved. Well, when we saw it advertised uh, initially, she saw this color and said, oh, I love this. <laughs> so tell me about go ahead so that she yeah I understand what happens next I'm a married guy <laughs> and here's the car that's what happens next oh I love this and here it is now we've got the ambassador script here we actually just drove it so we've got a we might have some bugs on it or something like this it is coming from a car show and let's take a look at this color in the sun as you can see and I'll get back so you can take that in. Notice the wood trim paneling, and that's all original. So the, share the story. She saw the car, and obviously she fell in love with the color, which I can understand. She pointed out that uh, I always got the cars I wanted, and <laughs> she wanted this one. <laughs> I love that. You know, you're getting what you want. It's time for me and get what I want. And I can see why she'd like this. And the SST that we see here is the upgrade package. So with the upgrade, does that include the wood grain here or? Yes. Um, that um, was the SST. The four-door sedan, interestingly, had uh, kind of a brushed aluminum in there. I believe it was instead of the wood grain. And there's the wood grain. Now that's kind of an interesting touch, that wood grain along the bottom, right? It's the era of wood grain. Yeah, the era of wood grain. Well said. Before we go into the interior, we're actually going to, since the sun is here, let's open up the hood. And we'll do the front. We'll turn it around. Wow. So this car, now you had shared that she had... Uh, saw the car online and then met the original owner of the car. Tell me a little the bit owner about him. He was a retired employee from American Motors in Kenosha, Wisconsin. And uh, we made the deal with him and a friend came and helped me get it and hauled it back. Wow. So you got a chance to talk with him and you can see that he must have loved this car. Now I see it's got air conditioning on it. Is and was that factory from the? Uh... Absolutely, it was standard equipment, starting in 1968. For the ambassador. For the ambassador. The the big dog. I know that tag right there. You see the information on it. Yeah, Cindy would share with me how she enjoyed learning about all the cars. And uh, it's really a treat uh, to be able to, to video her Typhoon 343 high compression four barrel vehicle. Obviously sad she's not with us, but uh, my expectation is we will meet at some point in the future. She can let me know how we Absolutely. did on this video. This is interesting too. Notice we've got these gutters that come back to this. That's very rare. You don't see usually They're that much handy space. For <laughs> Pretty handy for putting tools. Is this uh, this piece right here? Is that um, a that's, cruise control? That's the cruise control. Here's the uh, regulator. Regulator, There's cruise that. control. Yeah. And they go on the side. How's this one run too? Runs very nice, very smooth. Yeah. Thirty-two thousand miles now. Yeah, and that's original miles. Absolutely. Okay. Original. Let's since we're right up here, let's fire it. I'll stand behind it. We got a little shade behind. We'll step on the brake lights. We'll let it idle. Wow, is 
that's smooth. Now, did, did they have dual exhaust or you put that on? It was on the car. It was on the car. That would have been shared we'd show it to you from the back and there's actually a lot going on here number one you've got this piece that goes all the way across highlighting the word ambassador I like the fact that it's got these crests as though you're some type of a royalty person getting into this car and then ambassador and let's open up we've got the dual exhaust now, now you shared with the dual exhaust Tell me about uh, that again. The dual exhaust uh, with this engine, the 343 four barrel, it was standard equipment. And you can see here that we have, here's the sheet. Window sticker. Window sticker. We've got this information in here. And just because of time, I won't go through all of that. We have our, although it says 68 annual report, you can see the 69 ambassador there. And it goes through some of the details here. So we won't go all the way through, but there's our ambassador with the wood grain, as you can see. Now you see different wheels on there. We, tell me a little bit about the wheels the, that you uh, have. Have the original wheel covers, the turbo cast, they call them. Very nice. They, uh, I had a set of aluminum wheels called turbines from uh, a Pacer, uh, also used on a Concorde in '79 and 1980. So I thought they looked good in this car, and I put them on this car for now. So they're not the. They're not the original. They're to not this the car. original to this car. They are EMC product. An EMC product. New classic proportions luxury features. 69 was the first year with the longer wheelbase, 122 inch. The luxury of air conditioning. The DPL models. Look at the step down. The SST in the top of the line. I'm stopping there so you can potentially see that. So this is the SST model, as you can see. Now, I'm not going to go through all of it. We'll stop it there because we have more. That's your AMC attache case. <laughs> yes, that's the official. <laughs> go ahead. Let's open to the ambassador. Go ahead. And I saw, did I see SST in front of it? Oh, that's oh. Rebel SST. Okay. Yeah, this starts the Ambassador, the base model. Go ahead. And uh, the upholstery samples. This is the DPL with its fabric and the models. And then here is the SST. There is the SST. Now There's, she's got this one. This is the seats and arms. Yeah. The 992 Platinum. The Can we color. find the color? Go ahead. Right here. And there is the... Alamosa Aqua. Let me just go through the features of the SST with all the boxes checked. This stuff is great. Now, although this has got a lot of stuff in here, we've got the AMC American Motors cleaning box. Let's just tissue, open up tissue, the data book tissue to the ambassador. It's all the 
specifications. Yeah, all the specifications. So we won't go through all of that. But as you can see, the details just glorious. All right, we'll close that. I'm going to feature the interior, man. Yes. Can yes. I open it up? Can I open it up? Sure. Thanks. So as we come here, we have the sun hitting that just right. So you can see your body, your trim, your paint. Now, did the A-Track come with this car? It was an option. It could be factory installed or dealer installed. Factory dealer installed. A nice rough liner. There's that crest again that we saw. There's your horn. The SST to let you know you're getting an upgraded model. Chunks of wood grain across. Our pedals. Nice instrumentation. There's your air conditioning right here. Clock working. Lights. Washer. 32, just over 32,000 original miles. You can tell this one hasn't had its clock turned over, meaning it hasn't, it's not 132,000. And then down there, you have your ambassador logo right there for your passenger. And your AMC 8 track stereo. It's a factory demo. And a factory demo tape. Wow. Cindy, you know how to play them. You know how to play them. <laughs> By RCA, might I add. Lighter and your shift command that you can see right there. I like this, this over here. Desert only. <laughs> Low humidity areas. Low humidity areas. That's great stuff. This car is the individual reclining seats. Left and right. Oh, really? Show me how that works. Wow. We'll go to a rest stop and take a snooze. Wow. And it's got the dealer accessory floor mat. Got it. Got it. So uh, I think we should. Uh, I think we should take this one for a I ride. think we should. I really do. All right, let's do so it. I noticed when we opened the glove box, there was this interesting writing on there. Craig, this will be the first time you've ever seen that. And I'll close that. We've got the Ambassador logo there. We also found the lighter. And notice in the, you can see the sparkles in the floor mat. And this is an original American Motors floor mat with the sparkles in it, which I think the sun will let you see. Which is perfect. So let's uh, let's take a ride, shall we? Well, we've got you here in Lake Geneva, Wisconsin, and you can see we've got a beautiful picture of the lake behind us. How's it feel driving it? It's just super. Does it bring back memories of the wife every time you drive it? Oh, sure. And <laughs> even of going back to my youth with my dad, having cars like this. How much fun is it driving this one? Because it's just. Uh, it's just smooth and delightful. It's just delightful to drive. Let me just show people a little bit of where we're at as we're driving. This is a, this is riding in luxury, American motor style, for sure. I can see why she enjoyed this. Now, where are you from? You're from South Dakota? Uh, originally uh, from California, lived in Rapid City the past 30 years. Rapid City, South Dakota. Right. So we're, we're, we're finally connecting. She's been a fan of the channel. Does she make you watch or you watch on your own? Well, it was kind of mutual. <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was Sunday morning routine. Sunday morning routine. Make breakfast and eat in front of the TV and watch Lou. Watch Lou on some videos. That's great stuff. And what a great history this car has with all of the material in it. I'll just show people where we're driving here because it's beautiful. You can see how smooth that hood is. It's wonderful to be up here in Wisconsin. Just 
great stuff. Well, what a fun time finally meeting, right? It, yes, I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Well, I appreciate it. It's been such a treat, and I'm glad that you and Cindy have been such great fans. It's just wonderful to have a moment to share and share her memory and get a chance to finally video her car. And it was a treat when I got the chance to talk to her. She's such a fun person. So thanks so much for being on my car story. Thanks, Lou. Really appreciate it. You're welcome.